Hello coach, uh, welcome to the pre-match press conference of the game between ATK Mohan Bagan and Hyderabad FC, the second leg of the semi-final. Uh, we have a few questions from the media. We'll begin with the first question. It's from Mr. Ritam Basu from Sports Kida. Uh, so coach, what are the key takeaways from the first leg of the semi-final? And how big is an how big is a two goal advantage heading into the second leg? I think that was a a very hard game, but both semi-finals, uh, the other between Yanchetpur and Kerala, same. Uh, even they scored before us. I think they played better than us in the in the first half, especially the first thirty minutes. After more or less the the club break. Our team more or less uh, recovered the, the, the sensations huh, that, that we had during most of the season. And in the second half, we started very good. We scored two goals, two consecutive goals. And it's true that in the end of the game was very difficult to control the attack of ATK because they had very good players and every player who entered in the pitch uh, improved the team. Then we have we have uh, one very good score for us because two goals advantage is very good in one in one uh, uh, in one game like this uh, in two legs. And and let's see what happened tomorrow. Will be for sure will be very difficult, but for sure that we will have our options to, to qualify. Uh, Kush, the next question is from Mr. Wasim Zaidi from the KL now. Uh, so like you mentioned, uh, there were some issues that the team faced. So what are the areas that you're looking to improve on in the second game? Oh, uh, more improve, I think that in the first half, uh, we know to be brave. We can't go out Maybe because it was the first time in the history semi-final against players with a lot of experience. We have players with experience, but not all. We had some very young players in the pitch. We had, and uh, maybe this was one area to improve. Uh, and the other, I think that more or less we play with order. Is true that they had a lot of. Not a lot, a lot of attacks, not a lot of chances, but they were uh, very dangerous because they have very good players that only in, with individual actions they can decide uh, one game. Then we have to to try to not only to score, we have to try to play an, a normal game and, and try to win the game because we know that if, if we enter in the pitch only to defend the, the score, will be very difficult. Uh, so the next question is from Mr. Shiva Krishna from Telangana today. So like you mentioned, the team <coughs> bounced back after the first 30 minutes. So from 1-0 down, they bounced back strong in the second half, along with equalizing right at the half-time break, to then scoring two more in the second half. So what was your message to the team at the half-time break? No, this, I think more or less, all the people heard about this. No? We have to be brave. If we arrive to the semi-final, we, you are playing this ISL and, and your goal finally is to qualify to, to the top four. If you arrive to the top four and this day you are scared, so maybe you have to change the sport. Maybe it's better that you play individual sport, but if you play collective sport, you, you can be scared. You can lose, you can draw, you can win, but you have to play and sometimes you will miss one chance or you will miss one pass or of course but if you don't try uh, i think that uh, our mentality was very good in the in the second half and we were scared in the in the first minutes uh, course, the next question is also from mr shiva krishna from telangana today so you mentioned before uh, they had a lot of attacks um, in the end of the game towards the end of the game so a word from you on the HFC defence, which should, stood strong and managed to clear off danger multiple times. I don't know if we manage very good the, the defence because because they in the last uh, ten minutes, Kiyan shoot to the post. They, they 
they kick five or six consecutive corners. Uh, we manage very good the situation in the corners. You know? We defend very strong. Uh, in some moments of the game, uh, I, I think that that uh, is a good moment to remember. No, when 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 we played against them in the second leg in the regular season, they won to one. And I was totally convinced in the pitch, I was totally convinced that both goals from ATK uh, uh, were offside. When I arrived to the hotel and, and I saw the image, both goals were, were correct. And uh, Liston in the first goal, Mambir in the second goal, any of them were, were in, oh, oh, in, the, in offside, were correct goals. And I think that they had the, the, the same feeling the other day because they protested maybe four or five penalties. They protested after the game that the first goal, our first goal was offside. And after, you don't know because when you are in, in, in from the bench, it's totally impossible if, if it's handball, if, it's, if there is offside or not because it's, it's practically impossible. After, when you look the or you watch the, the image, I think that the referee in every decision, of course, he made mistakes like all the people. But all these, these kind of decisions, the goal was correct, any penalty was penalty. And, but I understand that the, all, all the, the coaches in, in, in both games, eh? uh, we are nervous and it's, it's normal. But I think that now, uh, after watch the sometimes the things that you look from the bench are totally different than the things that, that, uh, that they are. Uh, so the next question is like uh, you mentioned three games we've played them uh, this season. So we've seen ATK Mohan Bagan <coughs> go with a quick attack right from the kickoff. The moment they have kickoff, so your thoughts yes, on that? It's, it's the same for them. It's the same situation than uh, the last game against Janshit Two. No? They need to win uh, by, uh, with two goals difference. Uh, we know they have to start the game very strong. We have to equalize the beginning of of ATK, and and let's see what happens. I think that we have is in some moments will be more psychological than football game, uh, uh, full of mini games, and uh, the team who manage better this this kind of situation, I think that will qualify for for the final. But of course, we know that. I told no the other day in the press conference. In one moment, you look the bench, you look there, Ashutosh, Ravirdas, Kiyan. Bumus, Karma Q, uh, Mambir, then just a, a very, very strong side during 90 minutes. And it's true that it's not a skill. Eh? If they win the game uh, and if they qualify, I, I will be the first to congratulate them. But it's true that our physical condition in the last minutes was against Mumbai too, and the other day uh, we have to manage the situation and if we can uh, avoid the last minus like the other day, better for us. Uh, Coach, moving on from the team to the to few players, so the next question is from Mr. Ritam Basu from the Sports Heater. So, Ogbeche has also been taking a lot of workload this season in terms of defence along with attack. Uh, so, how, how are, happy are you? see his contribution in defensive I am very happy with Bartok Beche, but sometimes things that we only play with Bartok Beche. Uh, I think that uh, not only Javi Siberio because it's the same position, but there are a lot of players that uh, it's impossible that you finish second in, in the table only with one player. This is the, the, the real situation. Of course, we have the top scorer and is a fantastic player, but I think that we don't need to tell every every day. No? He, we know who is Bartok Beche for different teams, score goals in every team, maximum or top scorer in, in ISL. 
but the team is more than than Bart. Uh, I think that we have a a very good uh, team, and um, this is the this is the the, the situation that uh, this is the, the the reason because we are in now fighting for even for for a right to the, to the final. Uh, of course, the next question is from Mr. Vivi Subramanian from the Hindu. So, with one step away from making it to the final for the very first time, what kind of a mental framework do you expect the players to be? Take this game or and not think too much about the final. How do you manage that situation? I think nobody is is thinking about the final, but the same that in the championship. Eh? If you are a typical thing, no. If you have three games and you are thinking, oh, we need seven points in these three games. Usually, when you are thinking about this, the first game you you lose, and then it's impossible. This seven points of nine. Then we are hundred percent focused in in the game tomorrow. If we qualify, we will enjoy. During one day, we will play the final, and we will enjoy because the the stadium will be full. That will be full. Will be with with, with crowd. That is fantastic. And if we can't, okay, we'll be in the moment. We'll be uh, disappointed. We, we, we will be disappointed. But I think that the season is historical for for Hyderabad. But of course, we are not thinking about about to lose this this game. We are thinking that we can qualify for the for the final. And I know that all the pressure is for ATK because they need to win, they need to win something. The next question is from Mr. Moinak Banerjee from Chase Your Sports. So Yasir produced an excellent performance during a decisive period in the semi-final. How has his, be, how has his growth been during the season and in terms of reaching his potential? The season was very difficult for Yasir. If you remember, he played. He, he arrived to the in, in precision. He was very, very good. He in, in a very, very good moment. He he went with the national team and he played very, very good. The SAF. He was in the in the team of of the championship. He played very, very good. But when he arrived <coughs> here, when he arrived uh, to our team, he suffered one injury. He played very good against Mumbai, uh, but in the game against Jamshedpur, third game, he suffered an injury. Uh, this injury was for one month and a half. When he is very close to play again, he suffered. Uh, he had uh, COVID problems. No COVID problems. He had COVID. After COVID, it's not easy. But the normal Yasir is the player who the other day played uh, against against ATK. We know about his quality. We don't have any doubt about him. All all our players are very confident in in, in Yasir, and I think that in some moments we have bad luck with the, all the teams, all the teams. But in some moments we lost both wingers. We, we lost Halik in the first game and Yasir in the third game for long term tense. But uh, I think that uh, I don't I, I don't have to speak too much about Yasir because all, all of us know about, about the, the quality that he has. So the last question is from Mr. Amitabh Sharma from the Sports Star. Uh, your thoughts on emergence of Akash Mishra as a versatile option both in attack and defense for the team? No, I think Akash is a is a very important player for us. He's a very important player. Uh, he's young and he has to improve in a lot of areas. But for me, I told I don't know how many times that for me is the best left back. Maybe uh, another people can can think another another uh, another question, another. Uh, uh, other things, but uh, of course, he's young. He has to improve in some areas. 
for example, the other day in the goal with Krishna, maybe he was not in the correct position, but in another action he was very, very good. He saved some options, uh, in one in the, in the goal line. He saved uh, good actions, and I think that he played he played a, a, a good game. I think he's one of our young good players, but he has a, a still a big things to, to improve. Thank you, Coach. Those are all the questions for the press conference. Thank you very much.